the tropics. Welcome to Mizzou. Yo, this place is incredible. Incredible. Well, thank you. Did you happen to catch our junior tiger handler getting her hand bitten off? Ooh, boy, that was a show. Ah, damn, we missed it. But, you know, we're loving these monkeys you got here. Oh, yes. They're such majestic creatures. Let me ask you something. Uh, how much uh, one of these things go for? Chimps usually run around 60 grand. Whoa, that's no joke. You think you could do something closer to, like, I don't know, three grand or something? Huh. Well, I'll tell you what. I do have one chimp who might fit your budget. But he's not exactly in mint condition. Okay, okay, that's not bad, that's not bad. Yeah, he's, uh, something. I think he was used in a few minor medical experiments, but don't worry, he was mostly in the control group. Hank, we gotta do this, right? This thing's a freaking steal. Yeah, but aren't monkeys, like, a lot of responsibility? No, Hank, they're highly intelligent, self-sufficient creatures. Set it and forget it. You sure Tammy's gonna be into this? Are you kidding me? She's gonna be through the roof. What the hell is this? It's your new pet monkey. Happy birthday. You went and bought a chimpanzee without asking me? It's called a birthday surprise, Tam. I thought you wanted a pet. Yeah, I wanted a dog. Oh, come on, Tam. A dog is a low ceiling pet. At best, it can help a blind person across the street or smell a bomb on a plane or something. But a monkey, that's a high ceiling pet. Just imagine you're watching Summer House Reunion. You got the monkey. It's wearing a funny little outfit. It's serving you White Claws. I mean, come on. That's a dream pet right there. <gasps> oh, my God. Relax. It's fine. It's fine, okay? The guy showed me what to do. You connect this thing to the nerve thing you hear back here, and you, you just push until you hear a suction sound. Boom. All good. Ah, crap. So not only did you buy a chimpanzee, you bought a sick chimpanzee? <laughs> okay, that's all superficial. This is a fixer-upper. Mark, do you even understand that chimps are, like, way too dangerous to keep as pets? Like, this is no joke here. What the hell are you talking about? They're like the friendliest animals on a planet. Yeah, until they rip your friggin' face off. <laughs> this little sweetheart? <laughs> Get out of here. I'm going to work, Mark. When I get back, this chimp better be out of here. Oh, don't take it personally, monkey. Damn it, Hank. Mimi. Mimi, come on. Uppy. Mimi, go uppy. Oh, it's okay. Maybe we could just take a quick pick. Maybe. Help. What the hell? Mimi, stay. Whoa! Uh, 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 I'm gonna call 911. No, no, don't. Call police. Snake is illegal. What? Oh, of course it is. Oh. Um. Uh, what, what, what are you doing with that? I don't know. I was gonna stab it, cut its head off or something. No, yo, you can't kill it. Okay, this, this thing's worth 75 grand. What? What are you, Britney Spears? Who the hell owns a $75,000 snake? Some people enjoy a high-end exotic. Oh, yeah, seems like you're really enjoying it. Hey, could you just forget help me get it off? You know, maybe if you showed it more affection, it wouldn't try to kill you. Yeah. Let me try something. Oh, there, there, I know. Some people don't understand animals or anything. But look, I'm here, and you're loved. You're appreciated. Oh, my God. Ah! 